Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel after a long time. So uh, today we will uh, discuss about how to calculate the heater capacity installed in duct. So it may be a mixed air or it may be a fresh air. So I am uh, taking example of fresh air now. Like you can see here in a picture, uh, the cold air in and hot air out. So this is the duct heater. We will calculate its capacity uh, based on this example of ashtray systems and equipment chapter number 28.3 so in this case uh, we need uh, density of air which is already 1.2 kg per meter cube specific heat air specific heat which is 1 kilojoule per kg kelvin and Q is the required uh, like uh, ventilation airflow it depends upon on your requirement and this is the uh, room temperature and this is the outdoor air temperature so we will start in this excel sheet you will need to put here an outside temperature like it's uh, in somewhere in uh, your country it may be um, in minus it may be in plus and you just need to add this temperature the cold air in and you want to heat it up up to like a room temperature it depends upon on your uh, space like the example i'm i'm going to explain is uh, i'm going to uh, take a fresh air uh, the makeup air for kitchen like uh, the fresh air will go inside and it will heat it up to this element so i will calculate its capacity uh, here you can see these are two parameters uh, sorry three parameters one is fresh air one is supplier and one is return air so in my case there is no return air all is fresh air so put this outside temperature like uh, it may be a minus 28 minus 33 depend upon on your region and you need an inside temperature like uh, 24 centigrade room temperature and if it's kitchen for kitchen we will take 18 centigrade uh, normally the temperature of kitchen we, we do not want to uh, maintain a, a comfort temperature we just need a temperature uh, like it is not a very much cold it's uh, round about the uh, comfort uh, level it's not the room it's not something else it's only a kitchen so i will take a 18 centigrade it's uh, it's in canadian standard you can check it's uh, 18 centigrade of the kitchen and basement and for different it's uh, different temperatures so I will put these two and for this I will put a fresh air which is like a hundred percent of three eight nine three and I will put it zero because in my case there is no uh, no return temperature only is fresh air so I, I just took a, a very high uh, flow rate it may be a 100 liter per second or it may be oh, anything depends upon on your uh, like uh, in your requirement if you are um, uh, like passing a 100 liter per second of air through this uh, let me show you through this uh, heater it will cool down uh, sorry it will heat up up to 18 centigrade and the capacity is 5.2 kilowatts. So you just need to install a 5.52 kilowatts. It may be around about 6 kilowatts. So this is the actual heating capacity of this heater you are going to install. It may be electric heater. It may be a, a hot water circulation. It depends upon on like it may it may be electric. It may be a coil. Anything the capacity will be same. So. Today, this is this is very important in HVAC system to uh, calculate the uh, heating capacity uh, when you're going to install a uh, like a, a heater for uh, heating in your uh, space. So uh, this is this is a whole thing how to calculate it. So I will share this uh, uh, this Excel sheet in the video description. You can find it in the video description. You can download it and use it for your. Uh, like a calculation for your design. Thank you very much for watching my videos.